Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today, uh, I'll be discussing on how much I gain in grinding skin wasteland and how much um, materials do I get. Uh, this was actually requested by one of my viewer. Um, they actually requested on my grinding build. So today, I'll be showing you my grinding build. Uh, so for my stats, uh, I'm actually using max dex and max str. Actually, it doesn't really matter. As long as you can one-hit the mobs, uh, it's good enough. Then for my equips, um, I'm using Silver Bell for the cast delay and the SP cost reduction, uh, but mainly because of the cast delay reduction. Also, I'm using uh, plus uh, one I captain for the only mana, so I don't need to fill up my discharge. Then I'm using the same items that I'm using most of the time. So basically, that's it. Um, your main goal in grinding is to be able to one hit all the mobs. Uh, in all the mobs possible, so you need to make sure that your damage is enough. Then, um, for my stats already in my Brazil, uh, in my tree, I already have um three hundred percent of the the quick stand. But um, what I need to focus here for grinding is the movement speed plus the drops, the increase in drops. So basically, that's it. Uh, I'm just lacking a few more here. Then maybe afterwards, uh, I'll stop grinding here and just let them go to another place to grind uh, zenyx. Okay, um, for my food, I also ate the cast delay reduction one, so I could actually grind faster. So, once I use my my skill, my cart boost skill, my movement speed is actually 318% here in Wasteland, so I'm actually super quick. Super quick. Then, what else do I need to discuss? My skill build, um, I'm not doing macro or anything here, I'm just using auto. So basically, it's arms cannon, um, prepare for elite, AI, and pioneer drop. You need the pioneers so you could actually have a Madugir uh, fighting alongside with you. And you need AI because AI will automatically target everything near, uh, near the Madugir. Uh, as for my other skills, uh, I also max out my chain learning with arm scanner, so it could actually grind for me for every 4 seconds. So basically that's it, and I think we should now proceed in grinding. Uh, my spot here is Moonlight Grotto, Moonlight Grotto near the 9pm position. Basically this is uh, the position that I want since um, Moonlight Grotto has only one edit mob and the chances of you dying while AFK is really low lower than um, you grinding outside so uh, let's begin so i start with uh, my remains my remains at uh, 3 2 3 2 my dust at 9 2 and the agate at 6 6 so um, i'll be starting to grind now with uh, 240 stamina and my zeni currently is 221 444,769 so I'll, I'll start grinding for exactly 240 minutes and let's see how, on how much is any I get and how much uh, materials do I get with everything almost maxed out. So let's begin guys. Uh, as you can see, um, when I'm using AI, the Madagir starts to attack everything for every uh, every time it kills a target, it just switches to another target. So it's good to have AI with machine learning. Because if you don't have machine learning, uh, you, can act, you can actually utilize it. Hello guys, so I have finished um, my combat time at 240 over 240. So let's check out on how much I already gained. Uh, as for the Zeni, my previous Zeni was uh, 221,744,000 and now it's two, uh, 223,427,000 so basically it's around 1.6 to 1.8 million Zeni, raw Zeni while for the remains and the uh, other stocks um, I started out with 3,232 uh, remains and 92 dust and right now i have 4867 remains and 182 dust so basically it's like um 
for the dust it's like 90 per 240 and for the remains uh, I gained that around 1800 I think so basically um that's it um actually I did level up I did level up once and I think that's the only thing that uh, we need to find out for this one so um for now, my priority is still on getting the skills for the tree, but once I finish that, yep, I'm going to switch over to uh, other grinding places to earn Zenny faster. So that's it. Thank you guys and goodbye.